blessed summer to you. It is Thursday morning, the 16th of June, and I've had the good fortune to go out on a walk this morning already as the air warms up here. Those of us that are specifically from the heat know to get out early in the morning, which is just a delight to be with the birds as they wake up. And as the breeze is wafting through the air, we get to know the beginning of another new day. Summer solstice, tr technically the beginning of summer is next Tuesday. Heather Thorpe is gonna lead a summer solstice event uh, beginning Tuesday night. So I encourage you to look at the email to find out more information about that. Mostly unplanned uh, this Saturday night, June the 18th. Uh, as the cool air comes back in Friday and Saturday morning, we're gonna have a pop-up campfire uh, in, the, in the spirit of Farm Cafe since we had to postpone last Friday night's Farm Cafe event. This Saturday night, June 18th, uh, there's going to be a very impromptu come as you are, uh, bring your chair if you want to put something on the fire, fantastic. If you want to bring your supper, fantastic. If you just want to sit and be in community, fantastic. June 18th, between 6.30ish and about 9, we'll be gathered on our back lawn. New life is all around us. And I invite you in this summer season to take a moment to take a moment and to sit in nature and to notice all of the life around you in the particular details, in the leaves, in the colors, in the flowers. I'm watching a few bees right now do their thing over here on some astibli and on some cat mint. And I've been learning the songs of the Virios and relearning the songs of cardinals. And a few days ago, I, I'm beginning to learn the song of a wood thrush. And so in these songs and in the life that is all around us, I encourage you to take moments to sit within it, to receive it, and to know all the blessings that are in it. This Sunday, we will again be in the round uh, we will understand, we won't understand, we will enter a conversation of blessing and how we know life within our very moments, our breathing, and the very ordinary parts of our days. May we not run past them. May we not ignore them. May we live fully into our moments. We heard last week Mary Oliver say, live until you're no longer alive. Until next week, peace be with you. One more thing. I had to show you this picture of cat mint, which is becoming my new favorite flower. And to say just a few more words about our paver cleaners, this task is now done. And today, hopefully, gravel is coming, a track hoe is coming, and we're going to start on the wall and get some pieces of that going before we really do an all-hands-in invitation. So know that uh, life is going on here well, well, whether we are soaking in water or celebrating being uh, well together and getting dirty together. And as this week's video ends, here are a few pieces from a few weeks ago. Farm Cafe had their Take It to Ten disc golf tournament, which, by the way, we were one of the whole sponsors. And I want to say a big, huge shout out to you to continuing to support Farm Cafe and knowing that when we do that, our world expands in ways beyond our imagination. And sometimes we even find ourselves in a pond. Until next time, may you be well.